We're ready. Let's go, Sam. on the Annan and you know what this is becoming very quickly one of my favorite spots to fish we're back here and we're going to catch one of those bloody salmon today I swear to god we've got the lure rods with us we've also got the fly rod in the car as well just to spice things up a little bit later on if we're having a little bit of a tough day <laughs> so we've got the two lure rods with me we've got the salmon rod and the trout rod let's give it a go we're going to try and catch a salmon early doors high tides are early and from there Right, first cast of the day. We are defo getting wet. <laughs> Could already tell. Because I already am wet. Nice. Great effort. Great start. Wet after day one. After minute one. Cast one even. I didn't bring my bloody waders. I'll tell you what, that is moving in that current. Jesus Christ. She's not getting out there, that's the only issue. Not gonna lie, bit of a mare, I'm soaking wet. And for the record, I do have waders. They've just got a big hole in them at the moment and I need to go and buy some more. But as you can probably tell, it's pretty windy today. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drive over to the other side of the river and come at it at a bit of a different angle. I really wanna hit that swim before high tide and it's I've got about half an hour, so <laughs> I need to absolutely get on it. Sorry, I just looked to the right because I just saw a fish rise. A little bit of a mare there, but we've got, got ourselves sorted. We're back up and running. We're gonna head over to that other side. However, my first obstacle is the horses. I hate horses. I really hate them. Got positive news, folks. I'm on the right side of the river and the horses haven't attacked me. All very positive and I can fish this ridiculously big meps properly. Nice to see a little bit of fly life, always giving me a good sign. But there, let's just keep going and pray to Jesus. Horses haven't even acknowledged me. I'm actually now I'm just offended. So I've just been walking along as you do catching zero fish and just spotted a lovely ledge out there that I think might hold a nice trout. It looks perfect and it looks like it could hold something. It's like a nice little trouty stretch. Oh, I knew there was a fish in there. See how fish come in for it. <laughs> I knew there was something here. Is he gonna come back in for it? I don't think, I don't know what it was. I don't think it was a trout, but actually, was it a trout? Came proper in and nearly hit it. Couldn't, I have no clue what that was. This has been a seriously tough morning's fishing. So we're gonna leave this bottom end of the beat shortly and head, head upstream. I just feel a bit more confident, I don't know why. Just, I've had a couple of follows for some nice trout, but that's been about it. I just love, love doing this type of fishing. And I will eventually catch one. No doubt about that. What a morning's fishing. Absolutely bugger all. A couple of follows, but they definitely weren't nibbling. So we're going to go up further stream now. We're going to hit the island. It's a really big pool there. Hopefully, hopefully we might get a knock. In our last video, we had a really smashing hit there. So hopefully this could be one in there today. So come on, let's go for it. Ooh, 
Oh, I have to say, it's looking pretty nice. Nice and clear, regretting not bringing the fly rod with me. That is what I am regretting. But we've got a spinning rod. We're going to give it a go. It is a little bit low. So, hmm. Folks, we're here on a geezer called Ronald's bench. Big shout out to Ronald for this bench. They probably his family because they're bereaved, but. Hmm. Uh, so, we're here on the Annan, living the dream, and I thought I'd just quickly run through my setup with you today. So, what are we fishing? Well, we're fishing with the rigged and ready Predator rod. Absolutely awesome for the rivers, especially when you're fishing lures at about 20 gram. I've currently got a 15 gram Devonshire minnow on, yellow and black, absolute demon of a lure. 14, 14? 40 pound braid down to 25 pound fluoro at the end. Anyway, flipping fuzzy, right? Let's give it a go. Let's crack on. Let's catch some fish. Go on, my son. Well, the chances are with this in the tree very quickly. I don't think it's as deep as it looks to be fair, actually. I think it looks a lot deeper because of the scum. You never know, a salmon could be lingering underneath it. Anything's possible. Ooh, there was a fish here. Just saw it then. You know what, fuming. Should have brought my waders. I know they've got a hole in, but be able just to get out a little bit better and fish this just that slightly bit better than I am. Because I think the fish will be running on the other side of this fast current, unfortunately. But you know what though, we've just got to keep going, we've just got to keep working. This Devonshire minnow is absolutely working wonders down there. You can see it twisting and turning. Got a lovely flash to it when it's clear like this. I think we just keep going. Just keep working it through that current there. There's still a chance of something just on the edge of it. There's still a chance. We're going to fish down. I don't know if you can see it really. There's a fence just dang dipping into the, uh, into the water. We're going to fish down to there and give it a couple of, couple of runs through, I think. And then we've pretty much got this now all the way down. We're in a good spot. We're in a good spot, which is always a good thing. But hey, onwards and upwards. That went well, didn't it? Round two, baby. Come on. Let's be lucky. Let us be lucky. I flipping want an Annan salmon. Mainly because it rhymes. Salmon Annan. The Annan's full of salmon. You know what I mean? Yes, 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 Rig. It's a salmon. It's a bloody salmon. Yes, Rig. We've got a salmon on, guys. We've got a salmon on. I'm a Devonshire minnow. Second time round. <laughs> hey! That is what we are talking about, right? Don't think it's a biggie. But I'm not, I don't care. I'm panicking. Yeah, it's a salmon, all right. It's a salmon. It's not putting up that much of a scrap yet, but it's a lovely fish. It's a lovely fish. Oh my God. It's jumping everywhere. He's off. No, he's not. Not for time for net issues. We have tried so hard for this fish out here. We are not. He's jagging. Yeah. Lovely fish, lovely fish, lovely, lovely fish. Got to do the net. Right, the net's done. It's a big fish. Oh! Sorry, I am absolutely panting to death. I had a feeling today was going to be my day. I had a feeling. It's a big fish. It's a big fish. He, she's tiring. She's tiring. She's tiring, all right. She's tiring. Just 
fresh fish. I'm so, I'm sorry. I'm out, of, I'm out of breath. I'm so out of breath. I'm not losing him now. Ooh, not ready for the net. He's not ready for the net. But got it ready. Got it ready. All the hard work on this river. Feeling like it's coming. Coming to all its fruition. It is! It bloody is! When the lures come out! Guys, guys, I've finally done it. I have caught a freshly caught oh, spring of salmon, baby. What a beautiful fish. Oh my God. I've got to be so quick with this. This fish is about 10 pounds. I am absolutely bloody buzzing. Oh my God. Oh my God. Let's get this fish back ASAP. Guys, what a beautiful fish. What a beautiful salmon. Probably about, I don't know, maybe eight, nine pound fish. So letting it recover there in the current. She's ready. Oh, and she's off. Folks, I can't believe it. We've had an Annan salmon. And you can hear my welly squelching. Oh my days. What an absolute beast. That fish, the journey it's taken to get here and just to see it go back, absolutely amazing. Wanted to get that fish back as quickly as possible. Tried to keep it as low to the water as possible. That's why I'm absolutely soaking. Um, but oh, class, what an absolutely amazing fish. And I think what we're gonna do now is gonna head back to the car, maybe try and warm up, but I don't wanna make my seat wet. Problems, anywho and uh, have a little bit of lunch and give the afternoon a go. If this wind drops, we're gonna get the fly rod out. If it stays as it is where it is really blowy, I'm just gonna leave it in the car. Folks, we've called it a day there. There's a hell of a lot of anglers on the water today and yeah, I've flipped it out of fish, so I can't complain, can I? Bloody hell, first spring of salmon, baby. Oh, we have worked so hard for that and we finally nailed it. Should have not done this intro by a road either. Yeah. I'm surprised I've not been honked yet. Anyway, folks, tight lines, keep fishing. And if you've enjoyed this, please hit that subscribe button. Lots of love. <laughs>